medical and health content in Arabic language is growing um, exponentially. So uh, last studies we, ha we had were in 2011 and uh, we noticed that 60% of Arab use, uh, internet users um, look for uh, health information online. Uh, now, it, even more this year, are considering online uh, information as their primary source of information in, in matters of health and medicine. Well, uh, Altebi.com actually started as a medical dictionary that was written by my father, Dr. Abdelaziz al Labadi. Uh, he is a doctor, worked in refugee camps. He noticed the lack of medical information for the Arab population in general. There are no outlets offline or online that provide uh, medical information in, in, the, in the mother tongue of Arabs. Uh, so we started as a medical dictionary and then it evolved. We noticed a huge demand of, of uh, traffic so we, it, we evolved into a full-fledged portal that provides not only information but also interactive um, interactive services plus videos and, uh, and other features that provide a, a full cycle of information and services to the Arab uh, health information seeker, let's say. Uh, yeah, um, we, we're trying to look at, at ma many revenue streams. The major ones that we rely on today are um, basically direct advertising, banners and, and the likes. And then we have the premium listings of hospitals from all around the world that are targeting Arab population for medical tourism. Uh, these are the two major things, but we're trying to add more of proactive marketing into the premium listing service so that hospitals and advertisers uh, add value and uh, drive traffic to them by showing high quality content to the, to the reader. We foresee, as many others do, that it is going to grow exponentially. Uh, advertiser, uh, advertisers are growing more comfortable about advertising online. Uh, there is more knowledge and more information about that. Uh, in, in our own field of uh, healthcare and medicine, uh, we, are, we, we noticed through the past two years that advertisers are actually having now dedicating budgets for online advertising. So this is promising for the next two years, but I cannot quote numbers, specific numbers for that. Most of the digital initiatives are, are held by, by international uh, players. We're talking about the big brands uh, copying their digital models from, uh, from the US and Europe to this region. We're noticing now the growth of, uh, of the local offices and of local brands into this field. Um, unfortunately, pharmaceutical companies could, could, cannot uh, advertise directly to the consumer. So uh, we're trying. We're working with healthcare consumer products uh, that are easier to advertise and adding more value to the to the advertiser. Yeah, definitely. We have a lot of plans. Uh, we're working on many. Uh, we we want to grow uh, globally. We want to expand in more markets. So now we're aggressively uh, being present in Turkey, uh, more aggressively in Germany, and the UK, and hopefully the US. So trying to, to cater to global markets and and for premium listings. Also, of course with Saudi Arabia and UAE. Uh, we are adding more social services to, to our content. We want to add more uh, interaction between the physician and the patient, between the, the patient and the content, so that we cater personalized content for each person, just as he wants it.